you went for one of the most capital intensive businesses you could build. Why? If I'm honest, it was a mix of, I wanted to do something impactful. I wanted to build something. When I, and I kept, the voice in my head was wanting to truly build something. I wanted to build a team. I wanted to build a company that you felt and mattered. And what really appealed to me and what, when I knew I wanted to do Pure Harvest was actually, in the first months, I, it was just a thesis on paper. It was a great thesis. I understood the problem. We import all our food. Water scarcity is a growing problem and now becoming a nightmare. I thought we're tackling huge problems. So that check, like big, meaningful problems. And I knew there could be a good business there, but I also thought that was an exciting thing, but personally and morally. But then when I started to check out, could we produce at a lower cost than comparable quality imports landed? Yes. So it started to check and scratch the investor itch of like structural economic storyline, right? It, it, this can work and have compelling economics. Like if you think in game theory, it can be strictly dominant, in which case it's just about execution. So I started to say, okay, I believe this can work and make money. But the thing that really sold me is the feeling. You're you can feel you're surrounded by life. Like you can feel the war, like when you're in a tropical forest, you can literally feel life, right? And cleaner air, there, were, but there are bumblebees flying around because we pollinate with bumblebees. It felt like Avatar, you know, like so you're giant romantic. vines. Yes, there was a romantic element of it of like, I could feel you're going to build something, like physically build something. And I don't know, that that strikes into some piece of the, the rep reptilian brain, you know, some primordial man, I will build something. And I think uh, I remember that scene in... Um, that famous Tom Hanks movie, you know, scene where he smacks his chest, I have made fire, you know, and I, I, I'm not kidding. That's what I felt is that if you build this, there's something real and tangible. 